Howdy folks, welcome back to my World of Tanks replays with the Mighty Jingles. Uh, we're in the AMX 1390 again, this time it's a tier 8 light tank. 7.5 went live, French tanks from tier 5 up all got bumped up a tier, and the ELC AMX was introduced at tier 5, which makes the tier 7 AMX 1390 a tier 8 AMX 1390. How's it changed? Well, they've given it an extra 100 health. That's it. Um, there may have been some minor changes, but that's that's the only significant one. The gun still takes forever to load. Um, but it, it doesn't really make much of a difference. Um, with the matchmaker change, it's a tier 8 tank that can get into tier 10 games. Previously it was a tier 7 tank that could get into tier 10 games. The only real difference is now that there are tier 10 medium and light tanks uh, that you're up against. Um, and that doesn't really change the way you play this thing. It's still very much an opportunistic hunter killer. So we're here on the Crimean map. Um, what's it called? South Coast? I can't remember. Um, and I'm just waiting to reload, keeping an eye on the map, see what's going where, before I decide which way I'm going to take the AMX. Now I'm all alone on this side of the map. Nobody else is coming down this way. We've got some mediums and heavies who are pushing down the middle. We've got some mediums and tank destroyers that are pushing over the north, but I'm the only guy coming down here. Now, if they have bad guys coming up this road, our artillery is screwed. And that turns out to be exactly what happens. But there isn't a lot I can do about that. So I know that T110E5 has seen me, so I have to keep moving. If he's seen me, that means that E50 on the hill over there has also seen me. And then we run into even more trouble. It's an STI. Okay. Keep as much cover between myself and his big old gun as I possibly can. Don't drive in a straight line. Don't make it easy for him. Yes, he is shooting at me. Uh, oh, Tiger 2. Okay. Put a shot into him because it would be rude not to. But I have bigger fish to fry. So I ain't stopping going for their artillery. Yes, Artie, for all those times you one-shotted my French tanks, consider this payback. Now, this is a mistake. Because I'm still moving, I use auto-aim on this GW Panther, but look at the point of aim. Right, so I'm, I'm messing around here for a second trying to get auto-aim off so I can actually aim at a part that I'm going to hit. I've only got one shot left, but that's all it's going to need. Now, those of you who had a good laugh at my Type 59 on Ensk Herpaderpa video, um, this is another one. <laughs> um, yeah. I, ha I have a bit of a derp moment in this game as well. Um, now, I'm not loaded yet, but that AMX 1390 is only on 2% health. And I am doing 64 kilometers per hour. Ramming speed, Mr. Christian. Oh, AMX 50B on 8%, but I'm not loaded. And he does get a good hit into me. Now, observe. Here comes the derp moment. Come around the corner, we both fire, I kill him. Now, I'm going to pause the game here. I actually thought I was dead. Don't ask me how. <laughs> All I, a sudden rush of shit to the brain is the only thing I can think of to explain why. I just sat here. Uh, and we'll, we'll let things go. I mean, if I was to use... If I was in an external camera view here... It, in fact, let's pull out. It's bloody obvious my tank's not dead. But I wasn't using an external camera view. I was looking at this. And I came around a corner with a couple of hundred health left and took a hit from an AMX 5120. And I just assumed he'd killed me. What he actually did was knock my tracks out. So I'm just sitting here thinking, OK, well, let's wait for the match to end and see how we did. And it wasn't until I heard, tracks up, let's get going, that I realised, wait a minute. See that E50? Yeah, he sees me too. <laughs> And right now I'm thinking, huh? But I'm dead. Yeah, well, I am now. <laughs> so I did it again. <laughs> um, 
I managed to drive backwards for a minute in my Type 59 before I realised my gun was pointing the wrong way on Enzo the other day. Today I managed to sit still for an entire 15, 20 seconds in an AMX 1390 thinking I was dead when in fact all that had happened was I'd had my tracks blown off. So yeah, not my finest moment. But hey, it's a tier 10 game. We got four kills and we got some revenge on artillery. So I'm quite happy with that result. So um, uh, we won this one, by the way. It was a close run match. So yeah, um, well, I ho hope you enjoyed that. I hope you found it amusing. Um, yeah, I can be just as stupid as anybody else. <laughs> I mean, a lot of the time you look at these YouTube videos and nobody puts the videos up of the of the stupid moments. So all you, all you ever see on the games where they run up top guns and they get confederates and and those are fun to watch but I don't want anybody getting the impression mistakenly that I'm the greatest world of tanks player in the world because I screw up too <laughs> um, and I hope to be bringing you the more amusing of my screw ups in the future that was certainly one of them so I hope you got a laugh out of that um, I certainly did and I hope you enjoyed the replay and I'll catch you next time